Never joke with your utterance. Your utterance are powerful. Your utterance are spirit-filled. Your utterance are dynamic. The Bible speaking, it says in the book of Proverbs chapter 18, verse number 21, life and death lies in the power of your tongue. Your tongue carries life. Your tongue carries death. And so you must be very careful what you say. Your deliverance is in your mouth. Your death is in your mouth. Your healing is in your mouth. Your affliction is in your mouth. That's what the Bible speaking it says. Every utterance that man maketh, he shall stand to give account of it on the last day. Praise God. Meaning your words never dies. Your words are spirit. Your words are powerful. That is why the Bible speaks that by your words you are ensnared. By your words you are judged. By your words you are justified. Praise God. So there is miracle in your mouth. There are testimonies in your mouth. Listen to me. Your mouth is the greatest weapon God has given you. With your mouth you can defeat your enemy. With your mouth you can experience victory. With your mouth you can come out of that situation strong. With your mouth, you can march forward. With your mouth, you can be rendered useless. That's why the Bible speaks in the book of Proverbs 18, verse 20. It says, a man's belly shall be satisfied by the product of his utterance. Your marriage can be peaceful by your words. Your business can grow by your words. You can become so mighty, so great by your words. So mind what you say. There is nothing like, I'm just joking. No. That's why in the book of Job 22, verse 28, when men say there is a casting down, I will say there is a lifting up for me. When men say there is a casting down, I will say there is a lifting. Praise God. There is a miracle in your mouth. Your words are powerful. So use them wisely. Use them rightly. Wake up in the morning, bless yourself. Listen to me. One of the most anointed man of God in the world is you. So never look down on yourself. Never place a case on yourself. Never place a case on your husband. Never place a case on your children. Neither on yourself. There are self-imposed cases. Never look at yourself and say, I'm a good for nothing. Never look at your husband and say, he's a useless man. Useless daughter. You are useless. No. That is, you are bringing cases upon them. Because your words carry life. And so, have this mindset of speaking positive. Program your mind to always speak the positive. Look at yourself. I am wonderfully and fearfully made in the image of God. I am going somewhere. I am successful. I am making it. My testimony is near. I am born for greatness. And I must manifest greatness. My world is waiting for me. My help has come. My blessing come. For even the Bible says, the Lord calleth those things which are not as though the way and they come into being. So, apply God's method. Call your blessing. Call your testimonies. Call your wedding. Call your children to manifest. Call your finance. Call your businesses. Call your contract. And then you'll see them made manifest. Praise God. So, never joke with your words. For your words can either... Bless you or bring a curse on you.